It's time for episode four of the Megacorp. I'm sorry, this is this is the craziest one yet. This genuinely is the craziest one yet. Now, I thought that my RNG was good, and then it got topped, and, and then it got double topped. I don't even know what to say. Now, if this is your first time watching the Megacorp, then you should definitely check out the rest of the series first. There's a playlist linked in the description in the three previous episodes. Go and watch them first. For those of you who don't know, Megacorp is basically just a big co-op with eight people. Um, shenanigans happen, and we try to progress through the game and get a Hyperion and stuff like that. Now, I don't know if you guys can relate. I don't know if you're whether you go to work or whether you're at school and you have a few days off. Maybe it's, a, I don't know, like a summer break or you just take some holidays. You come back and everything is different. You know, previously you felt like the top dog and now you're demoted straight back down to peasant. Anyway, let's get into it. Just before we do, if you are planning on purchasing anything from the Hypixel store, make sure to use code NITROS, it gets yourself 5% off. You should subscribe to the channel, if you watch the videos and you haven't subscribed, please make sure to do so. You should join the Discord server, it's linked in the description of this video, we have for Slayers and Dungeon Carries, so if you need carries, or want to carry and make some coins, make sure to join. So I actually started off by doing the rift. Um, yeah, I decided to start the rift. Now what I will say is throughout this episode, we, we do kind of start the rift, and then get distracted, and come back to it, and then do something else. It's not really a constant Rift episode, which I think is good, because too much of the Rift gets a little bit boring. I'm so happy to be doing the Rift. So I started off by basically just getting the basic armor. Kind of forgot some of them are quite expensive. Then I stumbled through the annoyingness and pain of the bartender's quest. Then we had a chat with Inverted Cirrus. My eyes are hurting from the upside downness. Like, I love the Rift so much. You know? We, me, me and the Rift just have that sort of relationship, but I just love it so much. Uh, oh my god! Recently. Yes! No, I, I have to... I oh my god. I don't anyone's heard the song Mathematical Disrespect. It's my lucky day. Okay, so... Yes, uh, sir! Now, I've got to say, bottled Odonatas are the bane of my existence. I've never been um, the biggest fan, although I do love the Rift. Um, not the point. In fairness, once you've got the first one, it's kind of easy to get the rest. You just kind of forget how to do them. Yes. No, it's been a pretty recurring theme. Me and Oven have both been grinding towards, well, being able to fish for money and make actual good money. So when there's a Jerry event, we, we can't really pass up on winter fishing. We'll come back to the rift in a little bit. It starts. How many hours have we got left? Uh, ten and... Hours and okay, I don't minutes. know if I can do another 10 hours. <laughs> uh, should we do the rift? Oh. Nice. Look at the C6 and a water hydrant. We will take that all day long. You know what? You know what? Why not? We might as well just do this. Why not? Yeah, it turns out look at the sea is actually not good to have on your fishing rod, but I just simply didn't realise and didn't think to read what look of oh the sea actually God. does. Ink one is actually pretty good, right? It is pretty good. Yeah. Maybe to be fair, we could have just bought it anyway, but... <laughs> yes, sir. Can I give you everything you know? I wish I could. I'm so yeah, high. I'm moment. about a mutant. Um. I'm about a mutant. Um. Such a fire song, bro. You can't even hate. Yeah, uh -huh. <laughs> yeah it didn't take long fishing uh, until I started to lose my mind at all. Go, go, go. Oh, fishing 22. So I decided to upgrade my fishing gear a little bit, considering I was doing quite a lot of fishing. I was, um, well, I decided to gemstone my fishing rod and also my armor. And it, it sells back a few mil, but it wasn't too bad. There we go. <laughs> Let's see, my secret chance is now 63. Why is it still so bad? Because that's because of the reforge on the armor, isn't it? I don't have it reforged. That'll be it. Another one. Another one. Is there... Yeah, I really need to stop throwing, honestly. That's gonna... What even? What is that even giving me? That's giving me... Five secret to chance, yeah. That could have helped for a while. Yo, I got number one. I got number, I got number one in that, in the thing. Yeah, that cannon goes hard. Yeah, it really does. Oh my god, how much am I gonna get from this? I'm getting straight back on that cannon when I can. No, no, you're not supposed to leave it. You're not supposed to leave. Well, it. how do I get the gifts otherwise? It it goes into your inventory after. It's, oh, after it's fine. I got I got back anyway. It's fine. I got back. <laughs> that was the I, I that was like the fifth to last we got a golden I gift. There's no way that just you happened. Were give it 12. <laughs> I knew it. There's no I way. I told it. Yeah, I hate this. Twelve hundred gifts and we get it on like the one thousand one hundred and flipping ninetieth. <laughs> what is yes, that all about? 
<laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that oh is horrific. God. That is horrific. That is... That's so bad. Oh my god. Oh, I mean, at I'm least we actually, got it. I, uh, at I least we got one. It. No, I called it. It was going to be yours, and I called it. Oh my oh. god. Is it going to give me a hat? 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 Oh my god. You got I'll one? It. I don't know. <laughs> I'm still killing it. I hope it gives me a hat. I don't think it, it probably shouldn't though. Oh, no, give me a fish affinity. It just looks a little freaky from the bottom right now until like I replace some stuff. I, I don't. I, why was this urgent? <laughs> There's not really. There's just dirt there. Oh, okay. No, no, no. This dirt was already there. But was before, it? before, come over here. I mean, this is easily fixable, if I'm being honest. Like, we can, like, once everything is filled, no, 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 we can no. just place sauce box below this lava here. Below <laughs> this, uh, the floor. I don't know if... Okay, it's all filled in. But before... So, obviously, we've taken a bit of a break from the rift because it's been the winter island all day. Um, there's three minutes left of the winter island. And at first I was thinking, you know what, maybe I'll get to fish in 24. And at the moment, we're about 87% of the way from 22 to 23. <laughs> Well, not even fishing 23. Fishing just takes longer than you think. Even though I know it takes a long time. Oven got to 24. I'm jealous of that. Because um, that means if it's marina, you can get great whites. So if it is marina next, which I think it may be, you need to make sure I get fishing 24 before that because marina is good for money. Well, oh! You know you, you, know mean... you want to do mirror birds. The voices yeah, are telling I, you to do mirror birds. Yeah, I know. I love the rift. That's what I've been saying the whole time. I love the rift. I, I would love to do the mirror verse. It's my favorite part of the game. Oh, oh yeah, we, we're going back to the rift for a little bit again. All right, we got all the enemy souls in the wild woods. Um, the only thing that we've not done is Multizuma's second, um, which is saying there is a fragment of Multizuma somewhere in the rift gallery. We can't get to the rift gallery until we have the first time charm. And um, for the first time charm, we need to head over the bridge, over the little river. Um, so, yeah. I mean, it's, you know, it's going. Okie dokie, we'll take it. Uh, I think we need to get to the lagoon hall at this point. Okay, this may seem like too many little pads, so I would say lily pads, but that is technically wrong. I need to get across here and I, I don't want to die. That was way too many. Also, uh, yeah, I should have taken my shaders off while in the rift. It's a little bit dark. I can see perfectly fine on my screen. Yeah, sometimes it gets a bit ropey, but yeah, I should have. Uh, in the future, I will take the shaders off when I do the rift because it's a bit easier to see what's going on. We, we literally have so much to do on this profile at the moment. I don't know whether I'm coming or going. We need fishing 24. We need pattern 24. We need to do the rift. They're all things that I have, you know, in my sights. We've already done some fishing. We've started the rift. Every time I get around to doing the rift again, something happens and I just end up doing something else. This time I've pretty much got all day to go at this profile and, um, well, um, it's uh, it's three perk bloody Aatrox. So um, I'm obliged to do some revs. We need to buy a setup because, you know, I I've been waiting for this. You know, I've been wanting to do revs. Maybe we can get to rev nine. I don't know if we will or not, but I feel like we can drop something. Especially with it being three perk, we might actually even make profit this time. <laughs> uh, no, uh, we're going to do some Aatrox. Um, I'm going to buy some Reaper armor, and hopefully I can then still afford an axe of the shredded, but we'll see. Yeah, this is wishful thinking. There was some horrible miscalculations, and I definitely could not afford an axe of the shredded. But anyway, watch me buy one. Yep, I think we're going to buy this one. I know a lot of people scream at me for using one for all, and, and, and you know, if, if you don't like one for all, then that's fair enough. One for all is going to make me do a lot of damage at the moment. So I'm just going to use it. And sure, I'm not going to benefit from the siphon, but with Reaper armor, we should be good, especially with a zombie pet. I'm cringing so much. I don't even have the enchantment level for one for all. I think it's enchanting 38 and like enchanting 32. I don't know how I didn't realize. Yeah, we can't afford the full set. That's going to be rough. Um, We can get as much as we can. I think we may have to go for a bit of a hybrid setup at the moment. To be honest, because we've only got two pieces, which is not ideal. We need to buy those boots. Okay, I've tried to raise coins. Um, we have 3.2 mil. We, we, right, we should be able... I think we should be able to get away with it, though. Like, we're going to have to use a, a hybrid between Crimson and um, Reaper, which is going to be really horrible, but... Um, hopefully, if we drop something, we might be able to afford more stuff. Um, but we'll see. 
it could be worse could be worse this was a terrible idea um as you're about to see i can't survive and i also don't do any damage because the one for all isn't working because of my enchanting level i've got a feeling we might be selling this out to the shredded and buying the full set and then going for a falchion and then saving up for an axe of the shredded if we want one let's see how this boss goes because our damage i remember like with a falchion is better if we have like the, the full set my set's not going to be as good as ovens, though. I know that for a fact. And also, this guy's bloody helping us. Dude, it's nothing to do with the set. The one for all just simply doesn't work. You nerd. Yeah, we need to We need to solve this. Okay, we didn't end up losing that much. I guess we just ended up losing like a mill on taxes and stuff. So, yeah, we can buy the rest of our setup now. And um, a falchion. And then if we get any drops, maybe we can save up to then also be able to afford um, and actually shredded. But we'll see. Okay, so I just got um, Raz Avocados in the guild to apply Ancient to my boots because the cheapest Ancient boots were 10 mil over lowest bin, which is obviously massive overpay. Anyway, um, we need to get... What do we need to get? We need to get a Reaper Mask. Okay, so we, we have a set now. Um, not the greatest, but we can actually upgrade it as we go, so it's not too bad at all. We still, we still need a Falchion. I really don't know what I was thinking. I... I way overspent with the AOTS, like I would have been nowhere near able to afford it. I think we're gonna craft our own Reaper Falchion because it's way cheaper and there's no good decently upgraded ones for a reasonable price. Okay, now we're ready. We have we have our sword, uh, we have our armor, we've got our pet, we, we, we're all good, okay. We have 53 mil, so if we want an axe this ready, we have to make 40 mil profit. So that's, that's, that's the kind of situation. Okay, so I've just tried a boss and it went... Terribly. Um, now, the thing is, right now, is I have my uh, Reaper Falchion right next to my Aspects of the End, and they look exactly the same. So, I may or may not have been trying to kill the boss with an Aspects of the End that's completely clean. Oh my god, it's on the steps. Oh my god, wait, 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 I got a Scythe Blade, I got a Scythe Blade, I got a Scythe Blade. Let's go. I've now turned a profit from Rebs. Yes, sir. The first drop. Nice. Um, also, the reason why I was doing, doing so little damage with my um, Reaper Falchion is because I basically had half of the enchantments on that I needed, but I didn't realise because the GUI that I had on for the enchantment table just didn't show a lot of the enchantments. I had to switch, to switch back to the vanilla GUI, and then I could see everything. Really strange. There you go. <laughs> I'm not going to scum you. Thank you. Thank you. Minus 100 mil net worth. Woo. <laughs> Real. Wait, it's not even... Dude, nice it's not reforged. Oh, I, I'll reforge it. Hold on. Wait, I, uh, oh, oh, um... Oh, um... I, I, I don't know, actually. I ended up borrowing an Axe of the Shredded for a little bit anyway, so... Yeah. Oh, I got a Smite 7. Oh, cool. Oh, I got, a, be I got a beheaded horror. Uh, uh, right is this... Is this meta? <laughs> Kill the mini! I think it's the distinct lack of armor that's through that really does it, you know? Kill the mini. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah, I'm going. I got a side point. Oh my god! Um, uh, okay, I don't know why. Why is it? Why the comments are going to be slitting? Why, why, why does everybody keep saying? Why does everybody keep saying that I'm getting carried by you? That's not true. My yeah. guy, I'm not seeing oh, you hit your own boss even once. Guys, oh, whoa, you hit him! Whoa, and you did two damage. Okay, I can kill my. I can kill my own boss. Oh god, another side point. Why doing? I know this side oh, blade. He just oh. got another one. <laughs> okay, yesterday in terms of revs was absolutely crazy. We dropped four scythe blades and a smite seven just yesterday, and we're not even um, rev nine. I think we're a hundred k, just less than a hundred k away from rev nine. So I'm gonna get rev nine today. Uh, it shouldn't really take too long. Um, in the midst, we did get um, a frozen scythe. Um, I would have got a bouquet of lies, but I've still not got a full six completion, which we'll, we will do soon. Um, but yeah, it's the next best thing, and it, it's okay. Uh, bouquet of lies would probably be better, but I'm, I'm using this for now, and it works fine. Um, I am using, of course, this um, Axe of the Shredded, which isn't mine. I'm borrowing it. Um, but I'll be giving it back, you know, as soon as I'm done with revs. We're 37 million in profit, and we were 6 mil down yesterday when we started. So we've literally made, like, what, 42, 43 mil yesterday from revs, which is actually kind of crazy. Plus, another good thing is our rev armor is scaling. We've got, like, 10k kills on pretty much all the pieces, which means that we've got a lot more defense. It's actually quite difficult to die at this point. So, um, yeah, you know what? It's going well, actually. I'm, I'm quite enjoying revs. Um, I'm making money from revs, so why not continue doing it? 
Our kills are getting better. I think the best one we've had is like 14, 15 seconds. That was 17. It was a bit of a dodgy spawn. Um, I was doing some uh, revs yesterday with Yig. If you don't know who Yig is, um, he's a friend. And also, um, he's number two in rev XP. Um, he's dropped 120 Warden Hearts. And I guess he, he he brought me the side blade look. I think I dropped three with him, which is kind of cool. Plus, he's able to like one tap the bosses. So I guess you could kind of say I'm getting carried, but I mean, I'm not really getting carried because I can't kill my own bosses. But they were substantially quicker bosses than um, I could do myself. But yeah, we've got 94k XP to go. And considering it's Aatrox, we get a ridiculous amount of XP from each rev. So um, that 94k XP is probably going to equate to probably 50 bosses, give or take. All right, we got a shard of the shredded. Uh, 15 and a half mil. Wow, that is crazy money. I don't know how I'm getting so lucky. I've got everything but a heart. Well, okay, we're about to get Rev 9 um, once we kill this next boss. Um, I think I may go a bit further to see because we've got over a million stored in our uh, RNG meter at the moment, which means, you know, usually the first heart comes not really too long after a million, in my experience anyway. So, um, hmm. I don't know. We'll take it though for now. We'll click to collect. What are we? Rev nine. Idoki will take it. I don't really know what to do with this. Like, I just don't know what to do with it. It's it's not very good. Now I've got to say, I was really happy with the drops that I got from revs. Getting to rev nine. That's four scythe blades, a shard of the shredded, a smite seven. I made about 60 mil profit in about 600k XP, which, um, yeah, you can't argue with in the slightest. However, it's time to see how the other court members were going on. We're going to start with what everybody else would do, was doing in terms of revs. Now, Odie was doing revs, Hazard was doing revs, Oven did some revs but kind of stopped when it came to Aatrox. And for context, I kind of just, I, had, I hadn't been on my PC for maybe a day and a half, two days, and I come back to this. May I add, they're both using my armor as well, so I feel like I'm entitled to a cut. So, Hazard drops a Warden Heart, 100k XP before Rev 9, which is actually kind of mental. He drops here nearly 900k XP, which is, yeah, interesting, considering for the majority of that XP, you can't even drop a Warden Heart. I accidentally called Hazard Oni also, so it's it's even. I just don't want Warden Heart, Warden Heart, Warden Heart! He drops a Warden Heart at 163k Rev XP. Do you understand how rare that is? 163k! He wasn't even Rev 8. He wasn't even close to Rev 8. Yeah. I'm, I'm, surprised I'm surprised you don't want to go into blazes just so you can drop your own high classes. And them. Yeah, honestly. Oh my god. Oh my f- Warden Heart again! So you're telling me that 50k XP later, 50k XP, which is probably what, like, in Aatrox, somewhere between 27, 28, 29 bosses, he drops another Warden Heart, still before Rev 8. Very man, he's still 184k XP away from Rev 8, and he's dropped two Warden Hearts. Uh, <laughs> I just don't know what to say. Oh yeah, has it also got a shard? Okay, so... As you you know, the mountaintop has been being teased a lot recently, like a lot yeah. more recently, a lot a lot. They've been changing the entry requirement to mountaintop. They've they've teased it on Twitter. So I wanted yeah. to, to do vamp slayer and get the the vampiric time charm. So what yeah. I did was I went ahead and maxed the rift more or less. If I go to rift guide, I've I, mm -hmm. all done, all done, all done, all done, all done. The on top of that. I, I'm going to do some Vamp Slayer, but now, see, in saying that, I've used the art of lying and deceit, because I have also been doing Vamp Slayer, so, the, our current, my current progress is I've got three and a bit stacks of Coven Seals, which, if you don't know, the Vampiric Time Charm recipe was nerfed, and now, you only need a total of six, so... I've been able to do yeah. tier threes, and I'm in the. I'm at the problem now, where I'm grinding tier threes because I need to do a tier four, but I do not have the gear for a T four, because T four 
is hell. Now, on the topic of the rift, it is time to get back to the rift. Now, when I was doing the rift, Oni was also doing the rift, and of course, Oni is pretty much, he's not finished the rift, but you know, he's way further ahead than me. So, um, yeah, he was helping me quite a lot. And when I say helping me, practically carrying me through. But that's the beauty of a co-op. I'm not carried. But some may say co-op carried in, in some aspects. Think about it. Towards this Hyperion, I've not dropped a one heart. But at the same time, the co-ops dropped three. Probably not something I should be, you know, saying too loud. Ish. Beautiful. My I mean, forge is full. You know, throughout this whole video, how I've basically like been doing the rift for a little bit, then jumping and doing a lot more of something else and procrastinating. I do love the rift, don't get me wrong. However, this may have happened again. Oh, yes, sir. Dude, Watchdog has been putting in work like that. So I've just realized, well, I actually realized last night, but I didn't realize. I thought it was tickets I needed, but it's actually tokens. Um, that. In the event shop, we can upgrade because I've, I've, I've logged on early because I'm going to do some spooky fishing with Oven, who apparently is also going to log on early. He did go to sleep very early, so I think he is actually telling the truth and he probably doesn't expect me to be up. Anyway, it's not even early. Not the point. Um, so, yeah, we've got Spooky Festival and obviously we're going to fish. So we can actually increase our chance of getting sea creatures by 2% here. Um, we can also increase the amount of candy we get. Um... Yeah, that's really cool. Also, you can do the same for Jerry Fishing, the fishing festival. Um, so, I need to get some tokens. I think that's what we're saying. Okay, I believe that's uh, yeah, that's all of our, all the ones we can do for extra tokens. Okay, so, um, I do need to spend on Season of Jerry at some point, but the Spooky Festival is literally, like, right here. Well, the good thing about the Spooky Festival is this is the main one that we want. So we can just put most of our tokens into this. Don't know how much more to put into it, to be honest. Still have a thousand. Yeah. One more. Okay, there we go. Maxed out. Nice. And I guess the rest of it can go into... Jerry. Yeah, I think that'll do for now. Yeah, spooky fishing should start in like 25 minutes. So I think, until Oven gets on, I'm going to do some revs. Yeah, I didn't drop anything. But I leveled up to fishing 23 Oh, that's nice, I guess. So next is Jerry, either way, so we're going to get three per coin, <laughs> either way. That's true, but not... Uh, mm. Yeah, maybe you're right. I don't know. I just want a three per marina. I don't I don't want a one, I don't want a one per minister. At least it's the fishing festival, though, obviously, otherwise you shouldn't get voted in, but... One die. <laughs> You know, you know it's bad when I've got Phantom Fisher 5, and that's my only my actual first Phantom Fisher. <laughs> my yeah. god. I rev spawned! No! No, where is it? Oh no! Oh, I gotta hide! I gotta hide your head! I gotta hide your head! You did? Oh, nice. Oh, I'm gonna die! 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 Don't die. Okay. Hey guys, can you, like, flip it? And, like, oh yeah, I'm clipping it. Him? I'm watching every second of it. You watch, there's gonna be a one heart that pops out of this boss and you're gonna be... If a warden heart pops out, I'll get on my main and give you 500 mil. <laughs> Alright, it's, it's a very scuffed boss because I've had to switch armor in between, okay. And I'm also using sighted. Oh dear. It's fine. It's fine. Gonna die. Come on! Oh, well that was very anticlimactic. I have never heard true words. The series where we fish to Warden Heart. You're cooked. Oh, so far, we've got I zero can... Warden Hearts. <laughs> you are well, It's like Manga yesterday was complaining that he's like Revan and Aid Berlin. He was, he was not getting Warden Heart. That seems like a Mango thing to do. Yeah, who would get who would get two Warden Hearts before Rev 8? <laughs> no one. See what happens. I'm not gonna. I don't... Come on, Luke chair. <clears throat> God damn it. Yeah. So, um. There's. Hmm. I don't really know how long there's left with this spooky fishing. Probably like. 20. 10, 20 minutes? Um. The spooky festival has ended, but. Spooky fishing continues for another hour after the festival. Oven's gone off, he got fishing 25. Which is fair enough. Um. And. 
well, I just realized compared to his rates, my rates are terrible, but he's basically a fishing level ahead. He's now 25, so he had Dark Scale and he had the Rod of the Sea. And um, I think he reforged his armor with Frozen Baubles, which gives quite a lot. So I was just getting nowhere near what he was getting at all. Like I'm 50, I'm now 50% of the way to uh 50% of the way to 24, which I guess is okay. Oh, we got a, a phantom rod. We did get We Huh? <laughs> Wait. We did get a phantom rod. But I have no idea where it's gone. I don't even know if a phantom rod's expensive. It probably isn't. Oh, it's definitely not, but I don't know where it's gone. It is here. It just appeared. It's 50k. Never mind. Now, some would call this a phantom rod. <laughs> Do you get it? Because phantoms are like, you know, like, yeah. We've, we've literally just had like three fan, fan, you know, phantom fishers like back to back to back. I don't know what's happened because it's kind of been taking me ages to get them, but we've not got anything anyway. All right, well, that is spooky fishing done. There's like 15 seconds left, but I'm just calling it there. Um, what is our fishing level? We started at like a few percent away from 23. And we've got to about 60% to 24. I would have hoped maybe we could have got 24, but with the setup that I have, I don't think that was going to happen. Now, I'm intrigued to see how much money in candy we've made because realistically we've not really made much money otherwise we've probably made maybe two or three maybe four mil from other random stuff so if we grab our candy bag let's see how much we've got in here oh actually this is gonna be this is gonna be relatively decent I think let's see okay we'll take it so insta sell seven mil is it worth uh maybe Maybe we put the sulfur up and see if it sells. If it doesn't, then... Oh, well. Also, I've, I've got a few more clips, mainly from Oven. He managed to get himself a legendary flying fish, which is pretty good. I know he's had quite a few of these. Um, the reason he doesn't have audio and I'm speaking is because, well, um, yeah, he's watching GTA RP in the background and there's some, like, police guy just shouting call-outs. Oh, there we go. Yeah, he's having fun, so there's no fun. Go, go! Minor. Someone visited our island and uh, Oven decided to just boot him because he dabbed. I honestly thought that was a bit tight. If you want to come to our island and dab on Oven, please feel free to. Now, I did actually do quite a, lo quite a lot more on the rift, like I said before, with Oni's help. And I just don't know where the footage has gone. Like, I 100% remember recording the clips. But I just don't know where... I, I, don't know where the, I don't know where the footage has gone. So I don't know whether I've accidentally deleted it. Or, I really don't know. I've even gone through my recycling bin. But, I, to be fair, I do clear, clear it quite often. So, yeah, I, I, I'm not sure. But I can kind of sum up what, what happened. Well, we have four of the eight time charms. We have just got the uh, the time charm where you have to speak to Barry. And then he gives you, like, a, a key. We need to do um, a lot more tasks in that area. And then we can kind of move on. Our rift guide looks like this. We've completed the first two sections... Um, for now, I'm going to leave the hacking for dummies because I'm terrible. Also, the ward against the fireball I will do. It's just a bit tedious. Um, it's, it'll be worth it. I've got the Enigma Souls though in West Village. Uh, Dread Farm. Once again, there's just a couple of um, Enigma Souls. The Beanstalk um, that I need to sort out. Um, and the boat, which I can do relatively easily. Um, in the plaza, basically, I've just rushed through the time charm, but I... We've got pretty much the whole thing to do. And then we can move on. But that'll be for next episode. So my current playtime is just shy of 140 hours. Which, you know, that, that's what it is. I think um, other people have probably got higher now. I'm sure Oni has and I'm sure Oven probably does too. Also, it's a bit off topic. But why is this skin not selling? Does anybody know why this skin isn't selling? Because I'm pretty sure the armadillo's... I mean, the armadillo is useful at the moment. And the skin's so cool. Like... I'm not going to buy one. And if you don't use the armadillo or you don't want to collect skins or you don't want to, you know, just spend money in so be it. But why, why is this? It's cheap as well. I don't know. I don't really know. Also, we're, we're getting closer on the lava. I'm going to try and get this done for the, for the next episode because we, we've kind of been slacking on this. It could quite easily be done if we kind of just stopped slacking. Um, I have 102 mil purse. I'm still 35 mil by crack. Um, I have probably got around about... Mm, just over 100 mil into my rev gear. 
Um, so when I decide to stop doing revs, I can sell that, or if I want money. I've got some other things that I can sell. But I think we're getting to that point where, I mean, the main goal of this series, I mean, our first goal is to is to get a hype between us, and I feel like we're getting to that point where we probably could put money together and probably be close to affording one, so hopefully that will happen soon. Also, if you do want to dab on oven, um, yeah, don't 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 pay attention to this sign dabbers will not be prosecuted this is lies now things that i still haven't done that were on my to-do list um would be fishing 24 which we're very close to it's just a formality i think we're about 30 percent away which you can do easily at any point and then also kata i want at least kind of four six completion and probably go for 24 um i want to finish the rift as well so that's probably what's going to be on the cards for the next episode maybe something else depending on how quickly i get all that done I am working on a pretty big video on my main profile as well, which should be really good when it comes out. I've put a lot of time into it and I'm not really anywhere near finishing it. So I'm kind of trying to balance playing this profile and trying to get that done. Um, and I also have a couple of other good ideas for my main profile, kind of like progression based videos. But we need, we need to focus on this at the moment. Also, I decided what to do with my Reaper gem. I did so blobbed it. Because um, why not? Anyway, thanks for all the support on this series. I'm, I'm glad you guys seem to enjoy it. But anyway, this is going to be the end of today's video. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you in the next one.